this is the second part of the histology of the male reproductive system. Slides to be studied are the prostate, the seminal vesicles, and the penis. The prostate gland is a dense organ that surrounds the urethra below the bladder. It is a collection of tubuloassigner glands embedded in a dense fibromuscular stroma in which smooth muscle contracts at ejaculation. It consists of prostatic alveoli or sacs lined by simple or pseudostratified columnar epithelium. Characteristic feature is the prostatic confessions or corpora amylacea containing primarily deposited glycoproteins and keratin sulfate that may become more numerous with age. Next slide is the seminal vesicles. The seminal vesicles are two succular glands located behind the prostate gland lateral to the ampulla of the vas deferens. There are three layers of the seminal vesicles. The mucosa, which displays a great number of thin complex folds that fill much of the lumen. The tunica muscularis, which is composed of two layers of smooth muscles. And the tunica adventitia, which is made up of dense collagenous connective tissue. On higher magnification, the mucosa is thrown into primary, secondary, and tertiary folds lined by simple or pseudostratified columnar epithelium. The primary fold is found near the basement membrane, which branches to become the secondary fold. The tertiary fold is found near the lumen. The lamina propria contains elastic fibers. The tunica muscularis surrounds the mucosa. It is composed of smooth muscles with inner circular and outer longitudinal layers that empty the gland during ejaculation. Lastly, the penis. The penis consists of three cylindrical masses of erectile tissue with a penal urethra inside the corpus pongiosum. The two erectile muscles, the corpora cavernosa, are located dorsally, and the ventral corpus pongiosum surrounds the urethra. This is the high power magnification of the male urethra. Most of the penal urethra is lined with pseudostratified columnar epithelium. Irregular outpocketings of the mucosa are called lacuna of morgagni. In the glands, or at the distal portion of the penis, the lining epithelium becomes stratified squamous epithelium continuous with that of the thin epidermis covering the gland surface. Small mucus secreting urethral glands are found along the length of the penile urethra. They are called the lithrous gland.